So a lot of Model 3 reservation holders are getting this email that they can go into inventory and pick up a Model 3 with the standard range plus battery. Uh, what that actually translates to is they took a bunch of LFP batteries and dumped them into their inventory and anyone could pick them up, including me. And we're about to do that right now. We've got 71 miles left until we get there. And we're starting to get a little bit excited. This is the LFP Tesla Model 3. And I think we're gonna be one of the first people in America to get it. Uh, we'll make sure we give you a tour. We have the floor mats, we have the screen protector. We bought a Neo Charge. Um, I've of course got my Tesla t-shirt on and we're ready to roll. Can't wait. One of two Teslas on order. We'll see you at the dealership. Correction. We'll see you at the service center. Just an FYI, it took about five minutes to take delivery. It was all done on the website. You just hit accept delivery and they hand you the keys. We reserved the Model 3 LFP exactly two weeks before we took delivery, so it was that fast. I'm sure you're all curious, what is an LFP standard range plus Model 3? Well, it's got a battery made by CATL imported from Tesla China Gigafactory. It is made of lithium iron phosphate without nickel and cobalt. It has been installed in Model 3s in Europe and Asia. So it does have previous applications and it has 10 fewer miles of range than an 82170C Nevada Gigafactory Model 3. Tesla was delivering about 15 cars at the time that we got there. So we didn't get a ton of footage in the 10 minutes we were there, but I was able to snap one of the wife beside a Model S Plaid also being delivered at the same time. So this is the LFP Model 3. It was given to me with 15 miles and 60% charge I had to go a reasonable distance to get it. So the very first thing I did was drive it to a supercharger, which was intimidatingly easy. Uh, my Apple wallet already recognized that I had a card on file, so I didn't need to do anything. Then got on the Tesla app for my wife. She added the car because this is actually her car. And after I drove it back, I was able to kind of teach her how to drive it and she's ready to go. So this thing was ready. It uh, actually is the same price as the standard range plus model three with 2170 cells. However, you just didn't have to wait for it. I don't know if there's any inventory left, but don't take the advice of every YouTuber saying that current reservation holders are getting this opportunity. Everybody has the opportunity to get a model three standard range plus with the quote unquote standard range plus battery. All you really need to do is get online and see if they've got one. Now inside it's identical, outside it's identical. I figure just inside that battery pack is all that we're looking at difference wise. And of course, 10 miles of range. If you want one, hop on the site and see if they got any in your area. Let's talk about first impressions. Uh, Connie, what do you like best about the car so far? Everything. <laughs> I love the one pedal driving, uh, totally learning how to drive again because uh, it's like nothing I've ever driven before but I love how easy it is to drive love when you walk up to it how it unlocks it remembers your chair your seating features and automatically adjusts to you man am I going to be spoiled with this thing <laughs> you know, uh, I remember you said something about the trunk oh yeah you can open it from the inside and you can close it from the inside you can open it from the outside. You can open it from your phone. <laughs> it's going to be a lot easier getting in and out of the car during work. What's the hardest thing so far about getting used to it? Um, well, the steering column. I have to remember that down harder is drive. Pushing a little button, P for park, push. And up is reverse. And that's completely different than anything I've ever driven before. So what do you think as far as size? Was it what you thought it was going to be? Oh, it's perfect. Um, I don't have to wonder where the parameters of my car is, are. 
Um, it's easy, like if I come up on a pothole or something that I want to miss in the road, it's real easy to navigate around it. Steering is very tight. I like it. Oh, and I loved it when I was at the light and I was the very first time I got into it. <laughs> I just barely hit it and it was like, shoom, it just went. It's fun. Are you satisfied with the acceleration? Love it. I know you've driven a Model Y Performance. Do you notice a big difference? Not a huge difference, no. Uh, now the Model Y Performance was, I think, faster than the Lamborghini I owned previously. I think this is pretty good as well. Like, I'm definitely not disappointed in any kind of way. I love it. Uh, very responsive when you, it gets you where you want to go quickly. And supercharging. Uh, we did a couple of those today. One in Hagerstown and then one to kind of top it up from the rest of the trip home total of 20 bucks and that was for basically one full charge that was literally, literally zero to a hundred percent um how do you feel about the time the amount of time it took super fast um took no time at all uh it was very nice we had a little snack in the car we got to watch youtube it's like a little mini vacation is what it feels like so what are you looking forward to the most about driving the car driving the car <laughs> literally <laughs> all right just getting in and enjoying it uh yeah it's so much fun i it's the best thing i've ever driven before is it noticeable not having an engine uh definitely it's definitely quiet smooth ride as soon as you let off the gas it immediately slows you down to stop just like that somebody pull out in front of you it's hundred percent you know you when you're on or off of the accelerator you are on or off completely it's not like a normal gas powered engine where you got to coast or hit the brake I never have to hit the brake we're gonna do one we'll do one fun thing and then we'll sign off this has been your sneak peek at the LFP model 3 and yeah it rhymes fresh <laughs> off the dealership lot or the service center lot because there are no dealerships. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one.